what you are about to experience is going to be intense and maybe even frightening. But throughout it all, just remember, I am here. My work has warranted me many names. Ghost whisperer, clairvoyant, freak. But I assure you, all that I am is a guide. A guide to take you to those beyond the grave. To give voice to those whose voices were silenced far too early from this mortal plane. A guide. Destined to be here with you. And all I ask is this. Is that you open your heart and your soul to the process. If you are closed off, we will get nowhere. And above all else, stay in your seat. Do you understand? Let's begin. I felt like he was, he was, he was right there. I, I mean, I, I, it was like I could feel him breathing. I mean, I know the light flickered, but it was more than that. It was, it was, it was like we were, we were, we were kids again, and made me feel safe. Well, I'm sure your brother will rest well, knowing he bestowed that security onto you from beyond the grave. Wow. I mean, they told me you were good, but. You really live up to your reputation. And thank you. I, I, I thank you so much. I mean, you don't know what this means to me. I don't know how I could ever repay you. Venmo? Oh, right, the 150 for the hour. Plus the additional $8. For the water. <laughs> Once that light bulb flickered, it was like that douche nozzle almost crapped himself. It was so funny. You don't ever feel bad for them? No. What are they going to do without me? Go to therapy? I mean, practically at this point, I'm offering a public service. I playing make believe and screen with a fake light bulb? Mm. No, the light bulb's real. One of mom's old rings is covered in some sort of magnetic material. Must have been a fad in the 70s. When I put an electromagnet at the base of this unplugged lamp, like the man said, there will be light. <laughs> that added with some hidden speakers and a little secret dry ice, and I come back again and again. It's nice to hear you talk about it. I mean, hey, it's a living. No, I mean, Mom, you don't bring her up much since. What more is there to talk about? She's gone. Are you really not coming? We talked about this. She's not there. It's an empty vessel being put in the ground. What's the point? You get to say goodbye. Our mother had dementia. I had to say goodbye every single day for two years. I've had my fill of it. Besides, I know best. There's nothing after this. We're here and then we're gone. And no amount of sentiment can change that. Are you here, Mom? I 
hope you're wrong. Never am. Hello, little lady. It is far past business hours, but I'd be more than happy. I'm Lucy. That's great. Hi, Lucy. As I was saying... Operating hours, I know, and I'm sorry, but I need to talk to someone. Great. And if you let me finish getting a sentence out, I could let you know that operating hours are over. But I would be more than happy to schedule a new appointment. And maybe I'll even bring out the crystal ball. Fun can be had by all. I don't need... I'm being followed by something. Something? Yeah. I can't sleep, I can't eat. My entire life is just... I can pay triple your rate. Would you like a water? You're blonde. I'm sorry? Your hair, it's blonde. In all the advertising for this place, your hair was dark, but not anymore. Hmm. I see you're a very perceptive young Is that a bong? No, it's a um, Romanian incense holder. Because it looks like a bong. It's, it's not a bong. So what brings you here today? My mom died a few months back. I'm sorry. I can't imagine what that's like. I wouldn't wish it on my worst enemy. Is that what you're wanting? To contact your mom? What's that for? The dead belong to their own realm. But when they're in our realm, they carry a sort of otherworldly magnetic field. So, when the poltergeists are here, the bulb will flicker, even if the lamp is unplugged. Would you like to contact your mother? That's just it. I did. Or, I tried. I was stupid enough to get this Ouija board, and I didn't think it would work, but when I talked to her, I felt something on my shoulder. No, it was my back. At first it was warm, but the issue is, is it's still there. This was days ago, and that, that feeling, that weight, it's grasping harder and harder. I made contact with someone, but I don't think it was my mom. It's here, isn't it? I, I don't know. I, I, I don't know what's going on. Lucy? Please help me, Gina. My mom is punishing me. I know it. For what? For not going to her funeral, of course. What? I mean, what a bitch I must be to do that. She took care of me and supported me, despite how spoiled rotten I've been all my life. Yeah, 
The last couple years of her life were difficult on me since I had to start taking care of her, but that doesn't make it right, does it? What? Do I think we're even? <laughs> that I served my time? I drained the life out of her for far longer than the dementia ever did. And to think, on the day of her funeral, just before she's lowered into the dirt to have her flesh eaten by maggots, she'll look to the crowd of beloved faces, and her no-good parasite of a daughter will be nowhere to be found. One last kick in the ass. One last stab in the heart by my no-good daughter. Oh, odd. That light went out. But we're all still here. Every soul, every spirit you mocked and tormented and tore out of their realm for your own selfish gain. We're all right here. You should probably run. Gina, one way or another. It'll be quick. Just think of this as a public service. Mom. Mom, if you're out there somewhere, please just know I'm sorry. I'm sorry I couldn't be as strong as you. I love you, Mom. How did I get over here? You don't remember anything? We were at the table talking, and then darkness. Please help me. I don't know where else to go, and no one else will believe me. Please. Please. I'll, I'll help you. You scared me, Jean. Jeez. Interesting funeral attire. It's been a rough couple of days. What changed your mind? I thought you said she wasn't even there anymore. Our mom's been there for us all our lives. Even with as much as we pushed her away, she's always been there. I need to be there for her now.
Are you ready? My work has warranted me many names. Freak, bony, and fake. But I assure you, if you open your heart and soul to the process, you might just find what you're looking for. And it might be intense or scary, but throughout it all, just remember, I am here. So. Let's begin.